One of my very favorite butterflies I get to see in our backyard is a giant swallowtail, and it's really, really big. It's maybe six, seven inches in wingspan. It's one of the biggest butterflies in North America. And here it is laying eggs on a citrus trifoliata plant in my backyard. And the eggs are so small, it was really hard to get a picture. But what was amazing is just a, an hour later, this happened. Oh my god, please finish! Five days later, I checked on the plants and there's some little baby pups on there. They're so small. Um, I counted several. They got, you know, they were getting bigger over the course of the next few days. You can see them a little bit better. They're tiny little orange squirts. And yeah, there we go. Kind of hard to focus on them, but um, these things get really big. And this is still, this one's even bigger than the other ones. So I think I counted around seven or eight. And of course, they're not all going to survive, but. There was plenty, enough for this plant at least. Look at that guy. Left town for about a week and then I came back and I did see like a large form of the swallowtail caterpillar over here. And it, did, it looked like a big poop. And I came back today, I was like, I'm gonna get a video and it's gone. And I was like, oh no, where'd you go? So I was like, it's probably, you know, ran off to crystallize somewhere so I was looking and I was looking and I was looking I was like you know I'm not gonna find it but I did see I think there's another little pup right there or poop <laughs> at this point I can't tell but they're actually I've, I've learned since I first started taking the videos that they're nocturnal because they don't want to get picked off by all the wasps and stuff so anyways I just walked back outside something caught my eye and I was like oh man there's an army worm caterpillar on my succulent pot but no look look that's it that's the one I saw yesterday that is going to crystallize right here on our porch I saw it. I'm so excited Aww. Thank you, bud. I'll be keeping an eye out on you, don't worry. I don't think anything's gonna go after it because it definitely, it doesn't look like any small, delicious caterpillar critter that a wasp would want. So that, that doesn't mean I'm gonna, not gonna worry about it and watch out for it. So here we go. So exciting. It's already formed its chrysalis, and now we wait. Good luck, bud. So early this morning, I opened my eyes and I saw a shadow um, that looked like a butterfly through the curtains in our bedroom, and I kind of thought, you know what, maybe that's it, flying away. Maybe it opened and I come out here later and it's sure enough the chrysalis is empty the butterfly is gone and the amazing process is complete and now I will be keeping an eye out for a new giant swallowtail butterfly in the backyard and I did see some more eggs on the citrus plants a few days ago so Gonna keep the process going, keep the cycle going as long as we can, as long as I have leaves to share. <laughs> and yeah, thank goodness for butterflies. They sure do bring a little bit of happiness in a kind of a crazy time, y'all. That's the giant swallowtail. 
Probably not the one that hatched today. Maybe one of its little brothers or sisters. So beautiful.